Is this thing on? Cool. All right, yeah. Let's uh, continue the song from earlier. And here I'll play it through once just so you can hear it. Bless you. some lyrics for there so Did I even name this stream? I have no I I don't even know. Okay, cool, yeah. 
It's got the right name. Okay. What up? Hello, everybody. Hey, Mom. Hey, John. I'm sharing it on social media, all right? Trying to be pop savvy about it. I totally did it wrong, too. You distracted me. All right. So, oh, crap. These aren't locked. Let's lock these tracks so we can actually work with my old computer. I, I got, like, I, I got the chorus lyrics down, so that's nice. Just gotta wait till this thing is done freezing, and then we can start with the bass. Start adding the bass and all the other st cool stuff in it. What is that little emoji? Thing's kind of creepy. Got my little lyric book here. If you can see it. Can't really see it, I guess. God, the freezing takes forever. Because this computer's processing power is so bad. I'm not a lefty. Well, I am ambidextrous, but... Which is... This is my right hand. It just looks like it's my left hand. Because if I point at things on the screen, it'll actually go to where I'm pointing. That's not my left hand, man. This is my right hand. I have the uh, camera footage flipped horizontally. <laughs> you know this is a right-handed guitar, so...
Okay, now that that's locked, finally. Let's add a software instrument. No, not, not that. There we go. John, you're being a you're being a douche. <laughs> How am I playing that guitar backwards, dude? I'm like Jimi Hendrix, exactly like him. Be like Jimmy. I gotta figure out if this bad boy is in drop D. Man, that bad, uh, this boy is loud. That sounds like it's in drop D, doesn't it? Y'all are ruthless. You are just ruthless. Since recording, hearing that stuff is not good, I'm going to use a pick. Wherever that pick went. Oh. Jesus. What a mess. What a, what a, what a mess. play there is that what I played I can't remember I'll show you I know my right hand when it goes across the side of your face. Oh! That's what I did. I wasn't talking to you, Mom. I was talking to John.
I got most of it down. I just got. That part, I, that part I'm messing up. So. Let's do it to it. Then afterwards, um, this is just a dry track bass. Then afterwards, I'll add some effects to it, make it sound really chunky. Good right mess up at the very beginning. Oh my God, where's my count? Where's my double counting? Two bars. Uh, yeah, I'm starting to get, I have, I, I, I just have a, just a chorus down for right now. And yeah, the title is Burning Out, I guess. That's, yeah. Yeah. It's got a nice melody to it. That's it. I had no baseline really worked out for my brain. No, I think I'll just let. Just let it, that last note go. Yeah, that's nice. That's a nice little bass line right there. It's really catchy.
Oopsie. All right, I have no idea what I'm going to do here because that guitar does something completely different. So. <sighs> Let's see, it's doing that thing, so maybe... Something like that, I guess? that note right there. I didn't hit the wrong note. Do that. Oops. Oh. It's coming from the other room. I can barely hear anything with these things on besides the music. <laughs> That was dumb. I was supposed to cut it off. So right here. There we go. It's really, the, this track is kind of like, really kind of like, uh, afterlife-y vibe-ish. If I, uh, uh, I, I believe. Like, it does sound a lot like afterlife to me. At least as far as the uh, chorus goes. Damn it. Yeah. God, I. It's so hot in here. Like, for no reason, too, because our AC does work, just not very good. And I've texted the landlord, and he's like, well, it's the summer. It's going to do that because it's just so hot out. I'm like, that's not how an AC works, man. Just get a new one, please.
It's so weird because he has like our landlord has these days where he's just really proactive about stuff, and then other days where he just doesn't care. Yeah, I bet it's really hot here. It's been it, there. It's been super bad here though too. Like really, really muggy. Working, I come home drenched and drenched in sweat. Like after I get out of work, it's it's ridiculous. that note right there back in okay yeah I wasn't ready for that halftime sleep <laughs> all right base is tracked down I guess I'll put an automation here. Show me the master track for it to fade out. What is on my face? What is? Is it dog hair from on my mic? What the hell is going on? All right, I got that fade out now so we don't have to worry about that put the master track away now all right all right now see we got drums the guitar and the bass I should probably label them huh bass guitar left guitar right ghost does not want to sing he's not he, he doesn't ghost doesn't want to sing he he's asleep he is his bed is his bedtime but he's not a really vocal dog not 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 often that is he barks at people but that they're two houses down the neighbors he doesn't really bark at that much anymore because he I guess he's gotten used to them which is good all right let's edit this base yeah that's what I'm thinking that's what I'm thinking it is it's not pleasant it keeps tickling my face All right. So what we're going to do with this bass is I got this neat little plug-in here called TSE Audio Bod. Really fills out the bass tone really really well. It's this little guy right here. So let's see, put the drive up a bit, put the high end up a bit. And that should be good. Ha 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 ha. And then we'll EQ it a bit too. Do 
scoop down here in between the 200 and 500 area. You do a low pass filter or high pass filter, whatever it is, if it'll let me grab the stupid. Thank you. And then put that around 40 ish area. And then. Right in the middle of the five, uh, 50 and 100 area. Yeah, boost that boy, put that boy a bit. This is like uh, just for audio mixing in general. <laughs> Flea's gnarly, a, a gnarly bassist, though. Like, John can attest to that, I imagine, because Johnny Boy does play that bass. He does slap at the bass. All right, let's listen to it with the... God, that really does go out. That right there is kind of like a no that that little like guitar line right there kind of reminds me of No Leaf Clover. And I was thinking that I could yeah, give it a clean tone to it. Okay, what I could do right there is give it a clean tone. And then put some dual guitar over it. Because dual guitar is going to go in these parts. Oh, right. I need a compressor on this bad boy, too. What kind of compressor do I usually use? I'll just use a regular one. The stock plugins that come with garage band. Let's see, up the ratio. Take down the threshold. Put attack time. Slower attack time. That sounds good. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's really leveled out there. Maybe small. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Oh, pooey. There we go. Just making these small little edits that will make it sound a little bit more real. That one sounds fine. There's this one right here, which looks fine. Take these, put them on this track. 
I wonder if I can get a really nice, like, clean tone from this. These, this, this plugin I'm using. Because I heard it a bit earlier. Uh, da, 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 da. That sounds like garbage. Let's see. Take the bass, take the middle out, get some treble. I really wish I could use Reaper, but it doesn't really work that well as far as the interface goes. Um, oh, there's another plugin on here that I don't need because it's an overdrive pedal. Did I not say go away? No, I said... Why are you being... Oh my god, why are you being such a butt? And the overdrive pedal gives it... gives the guitars like a natural distortion, especially if you put it before the amp head. Just in case of nobody, nobody knew that. That's a pretty nice, that's a pretty solid, clean tone. Add like some reverb and a core, uh, maybe like a flanger or some, something on there. Take down the treble a bit. Oh, and I haven't even edited like the guitars yet at all either. So those are that's just straight from the head to the amp amplify uh, the cab. Yeah, those need some work. Which is the easiest way to do this? Throw an EQ on one of them. So definitely need a bit of a scoop in the 5K area. Take that down. Probably about 12, 12, 12 and a half K right here. Uh, take the middle out because that's where the most the natural resonance is. Take a little bit of here out for the palm muting. And then Grab it, you! St I hate, I hate how this mouse doesn't work on this computer too, that well. And then here we go, high scoop round forty. Forty sounds good. And then save as. We'll call it, call it burning out EQ for guitar. Can't wait to get the new new computer. Says it's coming Friday, so this weekend streams will be on point. Although I don't know how I'm gonna get the compute be here to accept the computer. I wish I could just have it left at the store. I guess I could change that. For UPS because I'll be at work all day. Alright. <laughs> There's still some of the... That's better. Actually, yeah, I don't think I need the high pass here. Yeah, those will sit way better in the mix now. Okay. 
Okay, probably turn these bad boys up. About negative eight sounds good. Nope, too much. Go negative ten. All right, now keep it at negative eleven near. Now we can put some reverb on these bad boys. No? Okay. Guess not. It didn't want to let me. I don't even hear it. What is going on? It's not even doing it. I don't even hear the reverb. Oh, my computer is not having a good time. I don't hear that reverb at all, even though it says it's on. What about ambience? No, nothing there either. Okay, it's weird. My computer's not agreeing with what I'm doing. So we'll just do it this way. Let's get like a nice room reverb. I guess medium chamber will do. Maybe a hallway, maybe a medium hall will be better. But then after that, we'll probably have to lock the tracks in order for the computer to just keep up. Do 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 Yeah, no, it's too roomy. Let's get a hall. Let's get a do large hall like Doc Concert Hall. Because this is Doc music For the witching hour. I don't know what I'm saying. have to do there we go that sounds nice and then let's put like a chorus on there flanger or chorus <sighs> let's see how this ensemble sounds the symbolism boondock saints anybody Oh, that's too much. Uh, that's way too much. How does it sound out there, by the way? The audio and whatnot? I, I always forget to ask about that because I always think it's good, but sometimes it's not. I remember I was streaming with Cedric one night, and uh, <laughs> I had like a compressor on the audio here, so it sounded just complete garbage. That was my That was my mistake. That sounds a little bit more what I'm going for. Yeah, that sounds a bit nicer.
Nah, let's put that. Put the reverb up to about 18. Give it a bit more spacious feel to it. Yeah, that sounds good. See how it sounds with the rest. Look at all these look at all these little people in here, that's awesome. Thanks for joining. Yeah, that's the most people. Man. Hey, what up, Seti? Say hi to mom. Mom and John and Cedric are all in the stream. That's awesome. We got a bunch of other people too. Why does it not show you in the users chat though? Whatever. I ain't gonna question it. I don't know how this I don't know how that works at all. How you doing, Sid? You having a good night, ma'am? You know, surprisingly, you and John live in the same town, but you guys probably have never really hung out, huh? The yin and yang twins? Oh, wait, John's not in here anymore. I guess he skedaddled. Well, fine. Don't need my moderator anyway. I should just make Cedric a moderator, though, too. I'll do it later. I'll do it later. Wait. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It is her. Metal for life. <laughs> That's her username. That's great. All right. So we got all this basic stuff down. We got now I want to go in I'm gonna lock all these tracks because they're all set and good and that's gonna take a minute for that to go but now we'll go, we'll go add, add the uh, solo and the dual guitar I'd like to do vocals with it but it's like 11 30 at night and I'm very loud I mean the other day I was um doing vocals and i was at the very very end <laughs> of of laying down the tracks and rachel had just gotten home and she was like i heard you all the way out in the street i'm like yeah i'm loud i i i, I got a big boy voice Oh, it's Metallica for life. That makes way more sense. I mean, either or. Metal for life, Metallica for life. There we go. That's a little bit better.
All right, we are ready to get rolling. All right. Going to Rockville? No, hell no. I don't trust anybody at Rockville to be good about this COVID thing. That's insane. Yeah, no, I thought it was... I'm pretty sure Rockville was canceled. Did you already pay for the tickets for uh, the Guns N' Roses? Alright, let's see what we can come up with for this intro thing. All right, there, there's our first uh, quit out for the day. We'll see if my computer can hold up. It might actually not be able to. Okay, yeah, that, that sounds like a pretty good start as far as I go. Yeah, yeah, I, okay. That. Yeah, you weren't even thinking about COVID. That was my first thought, like, I know a lot of the places that have opened back up, they've had a second big outbreak, and there it is, I found it, I got the stupid uh, hair finally, it was in my mouth, gross. Yeah, I really did want to go because Metallica was headlining two nights with two different sets, but I just don't think it's worth it, actually. Yeah, no, they can't. They canceled it, and they refunded everybody their money. <laughs> uh, nice one, Ma. Nice. Yeah, that sounds cool. Yeah, Metallica is worth it, but all the other bands weren't. Like, all the other bands were pretty weak as far as, a, like, just lineup goes. So, like, I'd only be going... I'd only be going just to see Metallica and spending like $200 for all for those 2 days to see them is that's not worth it to me and plus we we saw them that one time with Avenged Sevenfold and that was a great show, especially when Metallica started playing, because they had that whole balloon thing, and then the fireworks. It was awesome. It's 500? Oh. 
Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I could use that for other things. Man, I could buy, like, a new guitar, acoustic guitar for that. Jeez. <laughs> I should have recorded that one. That was a good one. Damn. That was that was all right, right? Oh, yeah, 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 right. Yeah. Good math. Good math on there. You always are pretty good at math. Yeah, the hotels are not cheap. There we go. That was that was a good one. I'll keep that one. Yeah, the food there is super expensive and that's always the worst thing. <laughs> yeah. You got to have the booze to deal with all the really really shitty bands that you see there. The Rockville the other year, that one year wasn't bad though. When we got, when you had uh, picked out that um, Airbnb, that was pretty. That was pretty sweet. That was a pretty sweet deal, dude. Yeah, I'm sorry. I just, I, I can't do it. I got, I got priorities to take care of. And spending like five hundred on a concert, it's just. Not in the cards right now, because I just bought that new laptop, so. And I got my credit card to pay off. And... Yeah. All right, that sounds pretty dope. <laughs> Sorry, Ma. I gotta do grown-up stuff. And save up money so I can get the cr hell out of this town. Cause this town sucks. Nearly everybody in here sucks. <laughs> It is, dude. It is. That's why I refuse to do it. Real nice, Ma. Real nice. <laughs> right said <laughs> just screw it I mean I do that sometimes just like for like a day I'm just like screw this 
<laughs> yeah, man. I mean, I'm just trying to stay a lost boy forever. Never going to grow up. I ain't never going to grow up. Or however the song goes in Pan and Hook. God, I love that movie. That movie still holds weight even to this day. It's so good. Like it holds up over 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 the test of time. But that's just cuz Robin Williams was brilliant and so was Dustin Hoffman in that. I didn't, you know, I until until I was like 20 or something, I had no idea that was Dustin Hoffman playing Hook. Captain Hook. He did such a good job. You've never seen the whole movie of Hook? I'm pretty sure it's on Netflix, dude. It's definitely worth a watch. Rufio! Rufio! <laughs> oh, God, I love that. Okay, something sounds weird there. So... That's how it's going to go. That's how it's going to go. No. There we go. That's how to do it. It didn't even record. What blonky? <sighs> there we go. That sounds pretty good. No, stop. Why would you, why? Wait, is a double click record? What? Have I been missing out on that shortcut this whole time? No. What did I do? Huh, weird. Trivium Pizza Man? Oh, oh, you mean listen to the new Trivium album? Oh, yeah. Oh, I listen, I, yeah, I listen to that, like, consistent, like, constantly while I'm driving. That album is really good. The ending's a little, uh, loses a little bit of oomph. But that's only, like, the last two or three tracks. But every other one is great. It's all so good. Like Matt Heafy for this past two years has really been working on his voice because he blew it out like three times already. And I've been listening to like all the his vocal training and it has really helped me too. Because now I was talking to Cedric about this the other day. I can sing for like two hours nonstop 
and not get tired. Like I do it in my car, like train and try and keep it up. You just need a warm up and then you're pretty much solid for the whole time. Today, my voice was a little shaky, but yeah, no, like his vocal trainer, um, I was like watching some of the stuff that they uh, do together and it really, really helps because for a while there and also quitting, having quit cigarettes helps too. For a while there, I lost about an octave in my voice. Like I couldn't go the really, really high highs. Like think cemetery gates, end of cemetery gates highs. Like I used to be able to do that really, really well. Yeah. Yeah. Like I used to be able to do those uh, highs at the very end of cemetery gates really well, but then for uh, a year, I think I lost that o- that that octave of my voice. I got it back now though. So, like I have actually gained a whole another octave as far as that goes as well too so i can go even higher now like listening to periphery really helps with that because spencer he's got these high really like really 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 high notes that he hits because they're they play in drop c and it's why it's nuts the range that that dude has but yeah that mom that's a band that you should check out now spell it here for you If you go look at them, they're really good. Oh, and here's another band that you should check out too. They are really, really politically angry and stuff. They're one, they're a little bit newer, but their music is really, really good. Like really good. It's super, uh, super poppy and stuff. So if you like, uh, if you want something upbeat, definitely listen to them. <laughs> yeah, I'll pull a Michael Jackson. Hee hee. Jump on. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather you not, please. Wait, what happened there? Oh, man audio cut out it does that sometimes let's try it gotta do it again we go (laughs) woman problems 101 (laughs) I don't have that problem I don't got nails especially because I play guitar all the time gotta cut them short Nah, I want to tighten that up a bit. There we go. There we go. That sounds nice. Yeah. Easy to grow nails when you don't have to do any do do stuff with the hands, I know. My hair and my nails grow like crazy though. I have to cut my nails like every week. It's ridiculous. Why did you do this to me? You gave me so much facial hair and just the ability to grow all this fa- I mean, I only got this cut a month ago. It's ridiculous. You gave me so much hair, Ma. (laughs) Yeah, that sounds good. 
Uh, and then we'll paste. Just copy paste for right here. That's the right area. Well, yeah, I was expecting to be more like that because I got the I got the native skin. But I, I didn't get the hairless thing. That's for sure. I got a lot of hair. I'm a I'm a hairy boy. I need like a little do 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 like maybe 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 do a piano part like right there would be nice to fill in some of the space. That sounds nice. Hello, person. A request song. Um, yeah, I don't know how to play that. I could go learn it real quick, but uh, <laughs> no. Right now, I'm not. I'm not doing covers or anything like that. This is just a creative stream for tonight. I'll go learn it and play it another night if you want to join back in. I appreciate the view, though. I really do. Why isn't this going? No. There we go. Polly want a cracker. Guess I better get off her first. 
That's a dirty song. That is a dirty, dirty song. I remember Nirvana was that, my pop's favorite band, wasn't it? Oh, that is way better. I don't know why I did. You know, I see all these streamers and stuff. Like, they have these, like, really, really cool, like, clear uh, chats that you they just have on the thing here. I want to learn how to do that. I want to get a clear chat so that I can just put it up next to whatever I'm doing and see what you guys are saying. But, yeah, hairless jeans do suck. I did get the best of both of you. Although I... No what? Wait, no. No to what? What What? what are you knowing? What did I say? Oh yeah, I'll need another audio track. Oh crap. Oh, it wasn't my dad's favorite band? What was his favorite band then? I could have sworn that Nirvana was like his favorite band. That's wild. I thought I totally thought you said that to me once. Crap, NSX. They're those. I like that band. I do. Hell, Julian showed me that. Yeah, NSX is pretty good. I think we saw them live at Rockville one year. <laughs> Uh, I like Nirvana though. I I really do. I, I I did like that. I did like, I do like Nirvana. They got some pretty good bangers in there. But like seem like as far as metal goes, they they seamless seamlessly ended the whole metal scene and started like the grunge scene. Them and uh, all those other all, all those other grunge bands and stuff like that. That was right around Metallica's Black album when they released that. A lot of people, a lot of like metal historians and stuff agree that the Black album was the last good, great, like the metal album of that era. And then it gave way, which, and then it gave way to grunge. Oh, really? Huh. I didn't know that. Oh, I learned something new today. Hmm. Yeah, that's dangerous stuff, man. That's dangerous stuff. Didn't uh, that actor die, uh, pass away from that, too? Bill in uh, Kill Bill? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big hair, big, big hair, big band, big hair area, yeah. Uh, the big thing now for metal is uh, Gent. 
D G D J E N T, and that's like a lot of what Periphery does. It's like really, it was really quick stop notes and stuff like that. Later said, get yourself some sleep, rest, man. <laughs> Sure, was Peter Fonda? That's it, David Carradine. Tar's ass right now. Yeah, David Carradine was the guy. I remember that name. Yeah, Peter Fonda. Uh, <laughs> I remember when I showed you Boondock Saints too, right? You had I. We had no idea that was Peter Fonda at the very end playing uh playing the Roman. The the. The story of the Esquerpo. Yeah, see. Si. You know, he's playing that really, really old, like, Italian. You are a destroyer. You, you are break things. See how far your tons follow in your footsteps. You know, he did a fantastic job. He was the best part of that movie. Other than that, the movie was kind of, kind of garbage. Gate is just kicking the guitar's crev. I gotta pull back on that for the solo. Uh, I think they are still doing a third movie. Um, I'm not really too sure about that, but yeah, buried alive. <laughs> I'm not really too sure on that actually, because I know they it was in talks, but with everything going on and just like the schedules for Norman Reedus cuz he's so in, he's so contracted into uh The Walking Dead. So 
I just don't think the scheduling works out for uh, either of them. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah, and he does. Yeah, he does that show too. I, I, I love the episodes that he has um, Jeffrey Dean Morgan on there. Oh, I love Jeffrey Dean Morgan. He's so cool. <laughs> Sean who? The other actor from uh, Boondock Saints? I can't remember his full name. It's like Flannery or something like that. It's really Irish. Yeah, like Sean Flannery or something like that. The last thing I saw him in was like a really, really crappy drama. All right, let's get back to this. That's it, Patrick Sean Flannery. That's it. I knew I, I I thought that was his first name. Yeah. Yeah, that's exactly what I saw him in too, the <laughs> the Hallmark movie. <laughs> it was so so bad too. Oh my god. And he has a English he like a really American accent, surprisingly. I had no idea cuz I've always heard him. Yeah, I I've always heard him as a brother. I've always heard him uh, talking like an Irish accent, you know. But then he, I saw him in that stupid Hallmark movie and was like, oh, God, You're, my whole perception of you is shattered. Yeah, I think you're right. I think it is Sean Patrick Flannery. Yeah, that sounds that sounds about right. Yeah. Yeah, it was really lame. It was really lame. <laughs> it up again yeah pat rock <laughs> i like that sean pat rock <laughs> Thank you. 
cool. Okay, I got an idea for this part. Yeah. Oh, crap, really? Oh, you just looked it up, huh? That's so sad. But, I mean, I, I kind of understand why they would walk away from it because it's been so long since they've it's been in talks that sucks oh man it would have been really good because they've both gotten way better at acting especially norman reedus like he's fantastic that sucks well say la vie that's too much <laughs> Maybe maybe no reverb, maybe just some echo. No. <coughs> All right, let's see. You. Man, I wish I had uh, recorded that little g g guitar line there. That was actually kind of sweet. That one was alright. The first one was so cool though. Oh yeah, for this I gotta take the gate down because that thing is crushing the guitar. Tone Forge. This is going to decimate my computer. Oh, wow. Yeah, that gate's at 100. That ain't supposed to be at 100. It's supposed to be like a 50. Jesus. All right. That should be better. I should have more sustain now. Oh, yeah, that sounds way better. No, botch the ending there. Yeah, I botched the ending. So... Yeah, 
yeah, I kind of want to. I want that pinch harmonic there. That was that was that one wasn't too bad. That's not pretty bad, pretty boy. Let's see, like kinda wanna end it there. Yeah, have that. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's that's that wasn't quite as tight as I want, like, good as I wanted it to be, but that sounded good. Yeah, see at the very end there, it's a little, uh, it's a little washed out. Yeah, that one was good. Nah, right there. I gotta get that really... Yeah, I gotta get it like that. we go that's it right there that's that's the take god that is it save that <sighs> poor poor guitar Okay, so now we got the whole big solo coming in. I'm going to lock these tracks. No, wait. Because I just had an idea for the solo here. What I could do is paste these bad boys for the first part of the solo. And then go off and 
into something else here. That'd be a good. Yeah, I'll do something like that. That's that sounds pretty cool. That sounded pretty cool. I didn't like the ending of it. I did not like the ending of it, but that's it's in the right direction. So can make that Oh, mess up the ending. Damn. Okay, yeah, this is going to be really cool. Nope, need to hold that out a little bit more. Uh, also, I need to change. That's wild. That's a wild solo. That was that was it. That was it right there. Oh man, I didn't get on the right pickup. But... Yep, that was it right there. Oh man, that reverb really goes on forever, don't it? Um, wait, what, I don't even have any reverb on there. Anyway, let's see. Make this solo stand out more. What I can do is raise 
the mids right here and give it a little bit of extra kick. That's it. It's a little bit of noise coming from that track though, so I gotta fine tune it a bit. Alright, I'll probably have to do some attenuation there for that. But other than, other than that, that solo is pretty, pretty kick ass, I think. And I only did it in a couple takes. That never happens. Also, I have to give this part. <coughs> the hell? Why is that happening? Nope. Not what I meant to do, pal. There we go. I have to give this bad boy its... On track because I got to turn the volume up on it. Oh, yeah, there we go. That's that sounds pretty that sounds pretty decent. And then outro part Again, I was not ready for that half time that that half time cut right there. I wasn't ready. for that ending. Yeah, have that hang out there too. Nope, 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 that was wrong. That was, that was not it. Where's the, uh, there we go. Okay, and for that, I'm going to need a new track because I need to take down the gate that's on the Tone Forge. Yeah, take that down to about 60. Should be good. Nice, nice. All right, well, that's as far as like instrumentals that were that that's that's it. I guess for right now, I could lay down like just a simple qua chorus for this bad boy. 
Ba 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 ba. All right. I have no idea how that sounds. I just do. I'm just gonna do soft singing for right now, because it's late. Oh, here. I'm going to go and lock all these tracks, so that's going to take a second. Because I don't need to edit them or anything, or uh, mess with them or anything anymore. And if I do, then I'll just do that. This is going to take a hot second. Oh snap, Chef Mike liked my tweet. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, I'm on Twitter now. Because <laughs> I need to branch out and like grow this channel. So I got myself a Twitter handle. And of course it's your neighborhood pizza guy because got to keep it consistent, right? The only thing that isn't that I didn't that haven't changed to your neighborhood pizza guys my actual Facebook because I'm probably not gonna use that for any kind of social media thing there just because Facebook blows <laughs> I only got one like and that was from him that's funny oh yeah I posted a new song on SoundCloud Ma so if you want me to send you the link for that I can do that actually I'll just send it anyway if you're even still in the chat I don't I don't know if you're here or not got a couple people here actually hello everyone in the wise words of spider-man aka Tom Holland Hello, everybody. Or, hello, everyone. Oh, I botched that up, didn't I? All right, new song on the way to you, for, for SoundCloud, at least. Oh man, I've been streaming for a straight up two hours. That's wild. It didn't even feel like two hours. This was, this one was fun. I actually had people talking. You and Cedric, it was nice. And John kind of just straight up left. All right. I'll need to get close 
closer to mic for that. But when I actually put the vocals down for this, might be tomorrow, um, definitely going to be more of a Matt Heafy kind of vocal style. It's just late and it'll be loud. That's not the right words, is it? There we go. That's better. I'm Those would be better. No, I got them all mixed up because they're written so stupidly on this page. I don't know why I did that. Okay. There we go. I think I might actually switch them around because the, the, the second part is kind of like has a bit more closure. <laughs> This is the old, this is all I have like as far as lyrics go for this like I said like the just the chorus <laughs> hold out that ending. It sounds kind of nice, like, as it is. I do, I, I do like the lyrics reversed, as it, as it were.
go. That's a good ending right there. Yeah, I'm going to switch those two around when I actually record. I guess this one can stay as it is. So what I'm going to have to do with this is get some compression going on and EQ it, at least for now. What I could also do is get this Thomas Munt compression. I can't see. There's a cup in the way. I like that chorus a lot. It's really pretty, but really sad at the same time. Man, that's a lot of noise. I'm burning out my... I'm burning out my friend Can't find my way back Not the EQs that I want I've fallen down again I'm out here on my own Alright, yeah, so what I'm doing here is I'm making cuts around the 100 area because that's where a lot of the base for that this mic comes from. Select it, please. I need it. And doing a high pass filter. There we go. And then cutting around the in the middle of 200, 500, about the 350 area, and then. Because most vocals are mid-ranged galore, you need to cut that stuff out. So that and this one's around this 1400 area. And then I just did a little bit of a small boost to give it some shimmer, shimmer. And I'll also probably do a bit of a cut here until tw to the 1200 region. So that should that should clear it up pretty well I'm burning out oh yeah that's way better my friend that's way better can find my way back that's gonna sit in the mix really nice that sounds way better getting into coding errors for all this crap I'm doing. It's probably getting really laggy. Sorry. All right. That should be good, like, as far as things go. Like, I could definitely double up the vocals. Bye. 
Yeah, they're going to sound a lot better and a lot like more um, um, oomphy when I do them uh, for real. But let's give it a let's give this whole this whole bad boy a listen for now because it's like pretty much done. I really like the bass tones that I got this time. Those sound really good. <laughs> Because I was doing something else. All right. Sorry about that. Sucks. Just use a hat. No, not right. Yeah, sometimes when I record with this thing, it just crackles for no reason. It's probably just because of the processing unit in this uh, computer.
That is a song. We just got to do the other vocal part to it uh, and actually sing it. So I'll probably do that. I'll probably stream that tomorrow because I could do that uh, right after I get out of work. And actually sing, sing the way I want. What you clapping for? This song or the one that I sent you? All right, let's see. I think I want to add something to this bad boy. The one I did? Okay, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, it sounds really nice. It came out really, really well. Like, audio and everything, it sounds really good. Surprisingly. Luckily enough for me, the computer's actually handling GarageBand pretty well. Alright, what I got here, though... is a keyboard. So I was going to see about laying down some piano in that chorus there, because I think it would sound... it would fit pretty well. When did I, when did I uh, texted you the song? Uh, not too long ago. It's yeah, I messaged you. Texted. I don't hear any audio. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let's see, legacy, logic, give me some, not keyboards, acoustic pianos, let's do a Yamaha Hall. That's fine, you can listen to it later. Uh, Oh man, it's taking forever to load the 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 plugin. <laughs> That's super loud. Just take that down a notch, huh? It's still pretty loud. Sounds good though. Uh, sustain. There we go. All right, so key is in this key of D.
there we go. Put that on there. There it is again. I usually play in the key of C. So I don't know. D. is way different for me because I usually do not play in that in this key I just gotta learn it So, okay. There it is. Okay, so it would be... It's weird. So 
bell goes dun dun. That's weird. I guess I can layer this. Ooh, I lost my place. I didn't know. I was going after that. That's where it goes. And then probably just rinse and repeat on that one so I could just... Ooh, my back. It cracked when I breathed in. Quantize this, see how it sounds. No, I think I'll just leave it. Mm -mm. Nope, not keeping that one. That was bad. That was really bad. Holy crap. I keep forgetting where it's going because I'm not used to this key. I did it again, yeah. I keep messing up. <laughs> God, I gotta, I gotta practice more in playing the key in, in the key of D on piano. It might keep setting my hand.
Why does this hand keep wanting to move up? It keeps wanting to move up a, up a step. God. See? I've been recording for too long now. I can't stay in my own head. Oh, they say that you're usually supposed to take a break like every hour, but I've been going for two and a half. And I swear. Mess that part up. I am just going to go from there. Wherever there is. There we go. Cool, I joined him. Uh... There we go, and then... Does that go after that? Okay. I don't think I like that right there with it. from That sounds that sounds better. All right, for here, I don't know where it goes.
And I think that's good. Yeah, I like that. I, I like that a lot. That sounds really nice. I'm going to put a compressor on it and take it down a notch. Ooh. I do like that piano in there. And then probably I'm going to have to EQ this guy too. Get it to sound. Probably put the EQ before the space. Okay. My computer just is <laughs> having a hard time right now. God, I can't wait for the new one. Let's see. Take down some here. Take down some there. Should be good. Sounds about right. Current track is locked. Thank you. I, I realize that. Yeah, computer. I think for this last one, the notes will be more open. Yeah, the, the, yeah, 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 yeah. Record that real quick. Because that's going to sound real nice on the ear.
That was not the right notes at the very end there. <laughs> so. All right. Yeah, that sounds really pretty. I don't think I need anything else. Just have the piano in there. I don't want to over stress the whole song. I might put like strings in there maybe. That might sound good, but I'll do that another night. For now, that's it. I'll let this play through one last time because I have to use the restroom and then... <clears throat> that will be it for tonight. Because I am a sleepy boy. Alright. There's that. And here we go. No, uh, I don't think I'll have the vocal. Eh, I'll put the vocals in. Why not?
I got to. It's just ingrained into me after working in hospitality for so long. All right. I got to do something with this, though. The natural degradation of those is a little bit quicker, so. There we go. That sounds that sounds pretty good. All in all. Drums Yeah. That sounds good. Alright, well, that's it for now. Thanks for staying along, Mom. Um I'll pro I'll probably do the vocals tomorrow or sometime this week. Cause it's it's pretty fun doing the streaming thing with all this. I really like the piano. That added a lot to it. But for now, boy. <laughs>